All right, mate, how you doing? Welcome back to another episode of Remember the Name, the Scott Pollock-inspired FIFA 19 Ultimate Team series. Make sure you've seen episode one and two if you haven't already. Last episode was a corker. I went up against the real-life Scott Pollock on FIFA in order to try and unlock prime icon Steven Gerrard. Check out the episodes if you haven't already. Today, I'm gonna to be starting off with the Friend of the Club challenge, okay? You know, there's Scott Pollock challenges throughout the series I've got to unlock to get certain players and improve the team. The Friend of the Club challenge means I need to beat someone that plays for Hashtag United in real life in order to unlock a player who's a friend of Hashtag United in real life. And who better to start off with than taking on this guy? Hello. That's right, it is Sebi Boy, uh, one of the originators of Hashtag United along with me. He was there at the very beginning, of course, and most importantly, you gave this series its name because you were the person that said, remember the name Scott Pollock. I just remember the marauding run he went on, wearing the original Hashtag Academy vest, dipping in and out of people. He oozed confidence, he oozed class, but in a, such a nice, humble way, you know. Mm, mm. Uh, you know, it, could, could you say I got a bit lucky? Maybe, you know. I've not scouted anyone else since, no. but, um, but hey, you know, of course, we have to remember the original phrase was remember the name of Scott Perkins. Yes. you got his name wrong. Well, I didn't get his name wrong. The real, there is another story to that you don't know. Okay. I went to university with a guy called Scott Perkins. Right. So his name was just on top of my mind. Right. So I just said Scott Perkins. Scott Perkins, if you're out there, I wasn't thinking about you. Is he any good? Not in a weird way. Scott Perkins is any right good. Player, Should we get him in Academy Series 2? We could do. <laughs> apply, mate, apply. But meanwhile, <laughs> Seb's got a console set up downstairs. We're going to play each other on Ultimate Team. If I beat him, I can sign a friend of the club for Hashtag United. If I don't, we have to go again until I do, mate. I need to beat you. Well, you know, I'm a competitive guy. I want to help the series, but I'm not going to just roll over for you, mate. It's brothers versus brothers in the day. He does not want me to beat him, but I need to do it. Let's go. Okay, reminder, this is our team. We got our informer, Che Adams from Birmingham, last episode. He's going to be making his debut now up front. We've got Akin Fenwell, who's been a revelation in centre mid. Scored a massive goal against Scotty P. You need to see that game from episode two. Hopefully, we can get some goals from Scotty P, get some attribute cards for him for future games. If we win this match against Seb, we can sign a friend of the club, which could be big. Before we crack on with this episode, though, the Remember the Name series is in collaboration with the guys from FIFA Mobile. Really good football app you can play on your phone. Here's my latest progress. The team is looking decent. New formation I'm trying today, 4-2-3-1. Going up against a field wing. Got five at the back. I'm definitely the favourite to win this, though. Come on. Van Percy is going to score. Surely. Oh, he's missed it. Oh, I've got to score that. Van Percy hits it. Is it a save? Header, rebound, yes. Cross it in. Head it. Oh, that's a beautiful goal. 8-3, we'll take it. 7,000 more fans. I'm going to open a premium pack. Okay, we built out the squad a little bit there. No one that special, though. We're going big for a round of 16 bundle pack. 79 rated Vida. Can improve our centre-back options, I think. Nice. Happy with my team. So there you go. That's what I'm getting up to at the moment on FIFA Mobile. If you want to download the game for free, you can visit the link in the description. easportscom forward slash Spencer FC. Get involved. FIFA Mobile. Right, let's crack on. Okay, let's see what Seb's team is like. To be fair to him, he hasn't played FIFA in a while. He's got some loans. Okay, he's using the loan system like Chelsea. He's got Prime, Ronaldo, 96, R9. He's got Anderson. He's got Son, off chemistry. De Bruyne, Lingard, Champions League. Maybe left back's a little bit of a weak spot. He's not a terrible team. He's better than my team, let's face it. But I've got Scotty P, the secret weapon. I back myself to beat Seb, especially as I've played a lot more than him. It's just whether I can stop him getting the ball with R9 and that five-star skill move, five-star weak foot. What a space in the middle. Oh no, this is what he can do with R9. Could be in trouble area here. Oh, wow, Cornell with a big save. Oh, what is that pass? That's absolute suicide. Cannot do that. Cannot do that, boys. We're in trouble. We're in trouble, boys. Oh, he's gone to ground. Get rid of it. Oh, back to the wall job again, I think. Adams, look for that ball. It's not the ball. I was trying to play it to the bottom right, but power will do. Could be in here. Got no one up with him. Unless he can dig out that pass. What is that finish from Hoskins? Gerard on the ball. Can we get a goal scoring opportunity with Stevie G? Oh, it's off the post. Got to go in. Is it onside? I think it is. That is the Stevie G effect. He's in the team and he's absolutely rifled that one. And it's a debut goal for Che Adams as well. Good little purchase, I think. Once you get that on Stevie G's right foot, he's got like 91 long shots, I think. Danger. Hoskins inside to Pollock. Got Stevie G running off him. It's for the one-two. Scotty P, can you get it off him? Oh, it's going to come to this man. Big save from Fabianski, the West Ham keeper. Pollock on the ball here. Can we get a Pollock assist here? It could be. It should have been. Why did Shea Adams not score that? We need the Scott Pollock assists. Felipe Anderson's got pace to burn here. Great work from the right back, Facey. Didn't get rid of the ball. We haven't got rid of it here. No shots. Oh, it's a fake shot. Oh, my God. What a strike. 
from KDB. It's always a Belgian. I can't let Seb hit him on the edge of the box area. He's got some great hitters. And Ronaldo's ducked under that, by the way. Okay, one all. Back to square one. This game could go the distance, just like the Scotty P game last episode. Scotty P on the ball. Into Che Adams. Can he find some space? Che Adams. Get a shot off. Oh, I don't mind that on the left foot. Two on his debut. We've got ourselves a proper striker. I think that was a Scott Pollock assist, you know. I think I played the pass with Pollock. We'll check at the end, but if so, I've got an attribute card for next game, which could be big. Gotta watch these runs in behind from Seb's players. It's not a bad knock. Oh, no. Oh, nine. Oh. I've had double his shots, a bit more possession, but the game is very tight. I don't really think I've got anyone on the bench to bring on. I want to leave it as it is, I think. Second half, here we go. Come on. Lingard's turned me there. He's thrown me a lot of the ball there, and he's got away with it. A good ball in. Oh, what a tackle from Taylor. The silver centre back to the rescue against Prime. R9. Icon. Had to go. Oh, he's playing some snazzy stuff, he said here. Is he going to shoot? Cornell is keeping me in this. He's off to Gerard. Touch. Shoot. Stevie. That one was straight down the throat of the keeper. Seb knows my game plan. Get the ball to Stevie G and hit one. Simple. It's good passing for the middle from Seb here. Trying to find that R9. Ronaldo. Oh no, spot a bother here. Oh, he's going to get a score. Ah! My defender got there, but couldn't clear it. Good left footed finish there from Jesse. Seb's footwork with Ronaldo. Ronaldo's actually been deadly. Oh no, he's through. Get rid of it. No! His strikers of the ball are just too good, man. He bought Tony Cruz on at half time. Didn't know he had him in his locker. What a strike. All right, boys. We're not looking good here. Scott Pollock on the ball. Still Scott Pollock. Still Scott Pollock. Oh, oh, I could have had a penalty there. I didn't mean to shoot that with Akin Fenwa. His pal, he's quick. Pal, Pollock, look for Akin Fenwa. Akin Fenwa, still Akin Fenwa. Pulls it in, hit it, deflection. Oh. Gerard, whips it in, bang. Pal with the header and it's gone wide. Pal, to Adams, to Gerard, Stevie G. Oh, that's not a bad ball at all. Chai Adams wants a hat trick. Oh, what a strike. And what a debut from the lad. Three of the best. I've never used him before. I just looked on the transfer market for a decent championship player. And he came to my attention. And what a purchase it was. Come on. Look at this strike. Oomph. Can't let him shoot. That's great interception. No shot. Oh, Cornell is a hero. We can go and get a winner here. I believe. Che Adams wants it through the middle. Go on, Che. Give it Akin Fenwar to the end of the season. Back into him, to him, one more. Oh, no! That was beautiful liquid football. And what a miss. Gerard, Pollock, Hoskins, Adams. Oh, it's a massive tackle. Akin Fenwa! Hang on, put it back in. No, I was trying to pass that. Good header from Chad Adams. That was no time. We're going extra time. Bloody hell. Getting some subs on just to freshen things up and put Marias on. Marias, Che, Akin Fenwa, strike it! Oh! Not now, boys. Not now. I'm in trouble. I'm in all sorts of trouble. Ah, it's like a dagger to the heart. R9. We're going to have to do a comeback again. Scott Pollock. Could be through. He's got no energy, bless him. He's held it up well, to be fair. Still Scotty P. Nice. Gerard! Hit it! Oh, as if... Gerard, got to get there. Yes, Stevie G, come on! We will not go down without a fight. These games are a joke. The Remember the Name series is going off. Pollock was instrumental in that. Oh, half time and extra time. Look how many shots I've had. Bloody hell. Pollock is knackered, by the way. Have you ever seen someone so knackered? He's only got 50 for stamina, but I can't take him off. Stevie G! Oh, what a save! Just splits these balls in behind to Ronaldo. There's nothing I can do about them. Wow, is that a cross? Oh my God, it almost worked. He still might. Well done, keeper. Marias, forward to the right back face. He was not stopped running this game. Is there time for a late winner? There could be, you know. Play it Stevie G. Go on, Stevie. Go on, Stevie. Put it in. Hit it. No, oh, what was that touch? I have to win it with that. It's penalties. It's penalties, just like the Scotty P game. We've got to do pens again. Is Seb any good at penalties, though? Woo -hoo -hoo. Bang. I didn't even mean to put it there. I've missed the first one. Not a good start. Wow, Seb's changing his run up on all sorts, is he? What a save! Cornell! He's unbelievable! That's a penalty for Marias. Come on! Oh, he's gone down the middle. Che Adams. That's a beautiful penalty from Che Adams. Everything's been unbelievable for me in this game. Oh! Okay, Seb has seriously dragged that. I don't know what he's done there. 
Yes, Aki and Fenwar, come on, Seb has to score. It's R9 Ronaldo, of course it is. I'm, t I'm staying down the middle. Yes, I'm in his head. Too easy. Yes, come on. I squeezed the win on penalties again. Unbelievable stuff. We deserved it. We created the chances, guys. Come on. Trey Adams obviously gets him out of the match. Three goals in his debut. One for Stevie G. We did get an assist for Scott Pollock, as well as Gerard Akin Fenwa, uh, which means we get one attribute card to use whenever I want to use it, probably on Scott Pollock next game. Yeah, Seb was dangerous that game, but um, I managed to get the win. That's big for the series. Look at those stats. Sebby boy, what a game. How was that for you? I mean, goals. What you want, right? Goals, eight, goals, goals. Eight of the best goals and, and some great goals from your boys. De Bruyne, Cruz. I had a strategy. It was shoot on sight. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> Both my games against Seb and Scotty P have gone to penalties. I've just squeezed my way through. But I have got a friend of the club, right? I want to talk to you about this. There's a couple of options I can go with here. Mm, okay. But I think I probably need to improve the defence. Yeah, well, we know... Four goals against me. I'm, lead, I'm letting too many goals in. Do we know any decent centre-backs that are friends of Hashtag United? I can think of one or two. I can think of an English one. Well, English one could be ideal for chemistry. Yep. Especially if they're an icon. Thinking yep. what I'm thinking? Former West Ham player. Former West Ham player, England player. Rio Ferdinand. Let's get him in, boys. Yo, Spencer. It's Rio here. I'm loving Scotty's story, man. Listen, if you need me to come and jump in, centre-half, marshal the boys. I'm there, bruv. Anytime. So when you're ready, bruv, just shout at me. I'm here. All right? Keep focused, Scotty. The work begins now. <laughs> So, I passed the friend of the club challenge. It's repeatable, so I can do it again against other hashtag players. I can't play Seb again, but I can play other hashtag players past and present to get more friends of the club. But in this one, I have unlocked a very special player who goes by the name of Rio Ferdinand. I've played this guy a lot this year. You can see 247 games I've played with him. So he's coming in to the defence. The squad's coming together nicely. We've also got an attribute card on Scotty P as he got that assist last game, so his stats have been boosted. I'm going to do one more game this episode, and I think I'm going to do the same challenge I did last episode, which is repeatable, which is uh, play an online single match, try and get a non-top flight player. That's how we got Che Adams, and he's been doing wonders for us. Okay, I'm going up against Fortish Juventus. This team is much better than mine. I'm going to struggle against this team. He's got Arnie. If I can get anything from this game, it's going to be a miracle. But if I do, if I get a win, I will get a new player signed outside of the top flight. Pollock. To Akin Fenwar. Powell wants it. Powell's going to get it. He's going to lay it back. To Akin Fenwar. Who's going to hit it? Rebound. Oh my God. Chad Adams is always there when you need him to. That's his fourth goal in 130 minutes of football for us. What a signing. Come on, boys. See this through. Get another signing for the team. Scotty P. Great first touch. We like this, Scotty. We like this a lot. Go on, Scott Pollock. Go on, Scott Pollock. Does he strike one? Ooh. You've got to hit him with Scotty P. He needs a goal. He's not scored since the first game of the first episode. Pollock. Not a percentage pass. Comes to Stevie G, though. He finds Che Adams! Oh, he's actually missed a shot. He is human. Pollock. Through to Adams. Can he get another one? Oh, it's just dribbled wide. That would have been a Pollock assist as well. So this Pollock and Adams connection is good. And let's face it, Scott Pollock's had a good connection with another person called Adams before. Ryan Adams. No turn. No turn and shot. No shot, boys. We are Ferdinand. That is why we brought you in, son. Adams. Hit it. Oh, what defending that is from Rudiger. Putting him on the weights. I can fend while holding on to the ball for too long. Uh-oh. We're in trouble here, boys. Keeper needs to come. Keeper has come. He's made a massive save. Tell you what, Cornell's been doing so well for us. We are Ferdinand. Showing us why we brought him in. Oh, it's going to be a goal. What a save. Unbelievable save. Cornell is the gift that keeps on giving. Scott Pollock running through here. What a ball that is for Scott. Keeper's coming. Scott. Scott Pollock. Yes. I tried to dink him, by the way. I was holding LB and it stayed low instead. And it's gone off the keeper. Scott Pollock gets his third goal of the series. His first goal since the first game of the first episode. That secures us another attribute card for a future game. Look at this from Scotty P. Oh, something's happened during the Scott Pollock goal replay. Oh, I think he's quit. He's quit. We'll take that. We've made him quit. Come on, he had a much better team than me. Scott Pollock running the show there. He gets a goal and an assist. Very nice. I'm surprised they gave him the assist for that first goal because it came off that Akin Fenwar shot and then fell to Adams. But I'll take it. It didn't give him man of the match on the first game of the first episode. It should have. So I feel like that luck's coming back around now. So we've got a goal and an assist for Scott Pollock. A goal for Che Adams and an assist for Akin Fenwar. That means we get two more attribute cards for Scott Pollock and... As we pass the challenge and won the online single match, we get a player from somewhere outside the top flight of football. So maybe another championship player. Have a look. Very decent performance. Actually, you know what? When someone rage quits, they don't give man of the matches. In my other series, I'd always go to whoever the highest rated player was. I need to go back to the ratings. Because if Scott Pollock was the highest rated player there, 
We've unlocked an England player as well. There's your proof. He's got a 9.1. Akin Fenwell got a 9, which means Scott Pollock gets man of the match, which means we also get any English player to join the club because that is a challenge as well. The man of the match challenge that happens in every single game. Whenever Scott Pollock gets man of the match, you get an England player of your choice and it's repeatable. So we've got an English player, a non-top flight player and two attribute cards for Scotty P. That's a good game. Okay, this is the updated team. And as you can tell, we are making significant progress, people. I brought in two new players, as you know. First of all, we've brought in Jack Butland, championship goalkeeper. Now, I've got to say a special shout out to Cornell, the goalkeeper who's made way. He's been unbelievable for us, but eventually he's going to get found out. We've upgraded him significantly by 22 from 59 rated to 81 rated Butland. We've definitely got an English core to this team. There's only two non-English players left. We've got Taylor from Wales and Buchanan from Northern Ireland. The other new player we brought in is the big man up top, Marcus Rashford, player of the month, 88 rated. We could sign any Englishman. And now, alongside the goal-scoring Adams, we've got significant potential up top. Our wingers have had to make way, which is a shame because both Hoskins and Powell have been really good, but they can be super subs now. We've brought in the original Northampton striker, Williams, who can keep this chemistry in this new narrow 4-2-3-1. So I'm buzzing for the next episode. Let me know in the comments below what challenges you'd like to see me take on next, what players you'd like to see me sign. Drop a like on the video if you're enjoying the series. Subscribe for more. Check out Seb's Twitter, uh, Instagram, and his YouTube in the description as well. Make sure you're following Seb if you don't already. Thanks to him for playing me. And of course, if you want to check out FIFA Mobile, the link to that is in the description as well. I'll see you on another episode soon. Until then, remember the name Scott Pollock and don't go changing. Don't go changing To try to please me You never let me down